fiber. You might have observed something similar when you try to thread a needle. Many a times, the end of the thread is separated into a few thin strands. This makes it difficult to pass the thread through the eye of the needle. The thin strands of thread that we see are made up of still thinner strands called fibers. Fabrics are made up of yarns and yarns are further made up of fibers. Now where do these fibers come from? Well, the fibers of some fabrics such as cotton, jute, silk and wool are obtained from plants and animals. Yes, indeed. And these are called natural fibers. Cotton and jute are examples of fibers obtained from plants. While wool and silk fibers are obtained from animals. Wool is obtained from the fleece of sheep or goat. It is also obtained from the hair of rabbit, yak and camel. Silk fiber is drawn from the cocoon of silkworm. In the last hundred years or so, fibers are also made from chemical substances which are not obtained from plant or animal sources. These are called synthetic fibers. Some examples of synthetic fibers are polyester, nylon and acrylic.